so for most of my incandescents, they're pretty much all right here. This is kind of what's left. At Sunland Lighting, what, what was on the have. shelf Monday Not will much. be missing Tuesday. No, you have uh, 25 watt light bulbs. Uh, These boxes of incandescent bulbs will now be dust collectors. Part of the store's inventory they can't sell. They'll kind of just be a little collection in the basement. Uh, hold on to them for a few years. This ban on certain light bulbs dates back to a 2007 law signed by President Bush. It required the Secretary of Energy to determine if there should be a minimum 45 lumens per watt rule. That rule was adopted in 2017 by Obama, withdrawn in 2019 under Trump, and adopted again in 2022. Most incandescents don't meet that minimum threshold, therefore they can't be sold. The more lumens, the more light it produces. The more watts it uses means more energy used. So take these two for example. The incandescent on the left produces 6 lumens per watt using 25 watts, whereas the LED on the right produces more than 92 lumens per watt and uses only 2.7 watts. LEDs also last longer. We need 15s, we got two left for you. I'll take them. <laughs> Bronwyn Wilson, like many customers on Monday at Sunland, were buying what they could before they couldn't. I'll probably get some stronger ones just to have a couple in my cupboard for lamps that I have stronger light in. And eventually, of course, we'll have to switch over in all lamps and all lights. So here. Yeah. So Store Scott selling these uh, these incandescent bowls that are less efficient face a $542 fine per bowl.